Hi YouTube, Susan here. Welcome back to my channel. I am getting back into Minecraft. Yes, officially. Um, <laughs> uh, as you probably know, if you've been following the Minecraft thing, um, they just came out with a, um, a new uh, patch version. I don't know. Uh, it's called Village and Pillage uh, Java Edition. Um, I play on my PC and uh, I was doing Minecraft all the way back when it was like 1.9, 1.8 something. Um, we are now at version 1.14.3. Um, I do have 0.4 loaded, but I only have the HD Optifine for 1.14.3. So that's what I'm playing. And... Um, I did have a series where it was a build a world with me series and I was doing things like an upside down dinosaur hotel and I was going to do a um, big uh, castle from Switzerland I believe it was. I did try and run that and I ended up uh, corrupting that world so it's gone. Um, unfortunately, so I am doing a fresh start here with the Village and Pillage Edition. And um, I'm basically just starting out this world. Um, I loaded it. I loaded the Optifine. I have the... Um, everything's all modified. I play in creative mode only. And... Uh, I have uh, daytime only uh, operating so that I can create things and don't have to worry about having a bed nearby in order to reset and uh, getting interrupted and stuff. So um, I have weather turned off right now so it's not going to rain or thunderstorm or anything. Once I have things built I will turn all that back on and have a day night cycle and the weather will be active. Uh, but right now, I just want to explore this world and find out all the new features and blocks they've got going on here. I already am fascinated. There's dolphins, there's uh, turtles, there's all kinds of stuff. So anyway, um, this world is mostly water, as you'll see. Let's just have a look around here. Um, I just let it self-generate. Uh, a random seed uh, but this one is mostly water but I do have a, quite a few land masses in which I can build bridges to and from each of them etc so I started over here see where that building is going straight ahead of us here um, I started over on this island over here and uh, built basically a home base where I can um, operate from. And it is not much in there yet. As I said, I just created this world not too, too long ago. So I basically built this three floor uh, home base here. And I haven't even furnished it or anything. But it was the first thing I built just to give myself a home. Close this or the ducks will come in. They have already. See them? They're just wandering around just looking for trouble. Um, if you can go up these stairs, that's the second level. Go up again. There's the third level. And on the top level, I have put just windows all the way around so I can survey the whole place and keep an eye on things. Even though I am working in creative and there's no um, creepers or anything that's going to give me trouble, um, I still want uh, the ability to look all the way around. See, here are these turtles. <laughs> Hi, guys. Uh, Larry, Moe, and Curly, the Three Stooges. There we go. Uh, now, what I did find already on here was one of those um, 
ocean uh, temples, which I have built a pathway to a uh, bridge, if you will, that also goes under the water, which is kind of interesting to do. And what I've done is uh, cordon off using the glass blocks um, all the openings to the temple and I'm in the process of drying it out <laughs> so I can walk around and breathe and everything else so that has been quite the project I've been on so far well there's some octopus and some fish um, I'm not sure what kind of fish they are but there there's a lot of them um, I have glowstones because before I had the Optifine, I had to deal with nighttime. Uh, I have some ladders here to get down to the next level with. Uh, uh, there we go. Now, now we're in the temple. Okay, let's go this way. And we go down again. There's all kinds of levels down here. And as I said, I've been in the process of drying this out. Four levels down. <laughs> I have all kinds of glowstones to, to light it up down here because there is no daylight down here. This is totally underwater. And uh, let me see if I can get to a spot where uh, I've been drying things out. Oh, oh, I gotta go down again. There's another hole. There we go. Now we're in the water. No oh, more fish. <laughs> Hi, fish. Um, what I've been doing to dry things out is uh, placing down sponges, dry sponges. And when you place it, it sucks water into it and goes to a wet sponge but as a result it is eliminating water down here now this is a long long process that takes a long time to do but with the glass block sealing off all the other entrances and stuff um, there is a finite amount of water here um, as you can see down here up here rather um, I have it is rather slow going when it's through water like this. Um, that would be open to the sea. Uh, but I have, uh, as I said, blocked it all off. See how the water is soaking into the sponge? So that is my big project right now is drying out this temple so that I can have a dry temple area um, to walk around in. And then I will go about building on the rest of the world. Now I do have, um, two other playlists from my other versions of Minecraft that I was, uh, working on. I will link those in the description box of this video and I will create a playlist for this version. So if you're interested in following my adventures on this uh, world, in this version of Minecraft, please join along and know that any videos I do will be in that playlist. And um, I'm looking forward to investigating just what I can find in this world and uh, what kind of creatures and things I can make. and whatnot so if you have any ideas or any suggestions please note them in the comment section below and i will have a look for sure i'm always interested in what you guys want to see too and um thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one bye for now